Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of trail aid explanation. In this video, we are going to cover unit compare groups with pre-group val and parent group val. This unit is from the module evaluate report data with formulas. Now, as part of this unit's challenge, we will be creating a report which will be using the concept of parent group val function. So how we can use it in our reports and how we can add this function in our reports. So for that, you have to quickly launch your trailhead playground and create report of case report type. So let's just go here to the app launcher, search for reports. We are going to create a new report and here search for cases. So no results uh, because right now we are under recently used. You have to go to all and here you'll find cases. Click on start report. Now, the very first thing that we have to do in order to create summary formula is we have to add some grouping in our report. So as part of this unit's challenge, we have to group our report by the type field. So let's just go back here and under group row section, search for type field. So this will group our reports based on the type value. So there are four cases which have mechanical type, eight under electricals, one for structural and seven for others. So there are seven cases under other type category. So the next thing is we have to save our report before we start creating our summary level formula. So let's just copy this and go to your report and click on save. Paste the name of the report here. Make sure to avoid any extra spaces. Folder I'm keeping as it is, not changing it. Click on save. So now our report is saved. The next thing that we have to do is create a summary formula. Now here for this summary formula, we are going to use the parent group val function. So how we can create this, go to this column and click this drop down, select add summary formula. The column name, I'm going to copy it from the challenge percent of total. Let's just copy this. Formula output type will be percent. Now, what our requirement is that this report should show what percent of each type contributes to all of the cases, right? So there are a few types that we had seen under each type, there were certain cases. Now, what actually we are expecting out of this report or out of this summary level formula column is that it is going to show us the percent of each type and its contribution in this cases. So what we have to do is uh, we will be adding row count. Insert this here. The, uh, add the division sign. Now here go to function at the bottom. You will find parent group val. Click on this function and insert this. Now here parent group val for this there are two parameters. Summary field and grouping level. So for the summary field our field is row count. So what we are going to do is we are going to add this row count again for summary field and grouping level will be grand summary. So this is our formula. The next thing is display. Go to this display section and click on specific groups. Here you have to make sure type is selected, though there is only one value. So type will be automatically selected. Then go to general again. And what this formula is actually doing is, so here row count will be given for each type. So how many cases are there? So that will give us the row count of the number of cases under each type. And then we are dividing it by using the parent group val function. We are dividing it with the total row counts that are present in our cases. So this is this will give us the percent of total that each type is contributing. So let's just click on apply. Okay, so oh, I'm so sorry, it has to be grant. Click on validate. Yeah, now it's perfectly fine. Click on apply. Now, as soon as you click on apply, this column has been added. And now you see here that it is showing the total percentage that each type is contributing. So right now we have four records. So four divided by 20 into 100. This will give us 20%. 
So four is the count of rows for this type. 20 is the count of the total because that we have whose value is coming from the function that we have at parent group well, right? Into 100, is, we are doing it because we, are, we want that data to be in a percentage. So you can uh, test this on your own for the other types as well. This will work same the way it has, the way I have explained for the mechanical one. So this was all that we have to do for this CNS challenge. Just click on save and run. So our report is created. We have our percent of total added. Let's just go back to our challenge and see whether we have passed this step. There you go. This unit as well as this module is completed. See you in the next video with another unit or module. Till then, take care. Thank you so much.